executing the hit and run, here's what you want to think about. The first point, always make sure there's less than two strikes. The second point is the runner who is taking off from first base has to find the ball. So when they're about halfway to second base, they need to peek in and see what that hitter just did. Because the runner needs to know that hitter is swinging no matter what, and they're gonna do everything they can to put the bat on the ball. The third point is if that ball is hit to the right side, that runner going to second base needs to immediately pick up the third base coach because if that ball is on the ground through the right side, that runner should be coming to third. The fourth point is the hitter needs to make sure the ball is on the ground. We don't want anything in the air. And to take it a step further, we want that ball on the right side of the field because we want to get that runner over to third base. 